hello there, Jums and I, Captain Stephen X. And today, Jums, we're going pulse fishing. We're going pulse fishing for Quicksilver, Interstellar, Ice no less. Heck yes, power band, power band. Wah, 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 wah. Yeah, got one of those. Yeah, just in case you were wondering. Right, here we go. We're going to be hitting in a code, and it starts with an eagerly mumbled bird, followed by a sunset. And then we've got ourselves a Bertie McBoat face, and we've got ourselves a Fishy McFish Fish, and we've got ourselves a Triforce. Heck yes, stick that in there. We've got ourselves a Reflection, and a TP or Wiggy Wham, and followed by another Triforce, and we've got ourselves a uh, Bertie McBoat Bird, and a Rocket. Yeah, no, no, we haven't. We've got ourselves a. Um, uh, a Triforce, then a rocket. Sorry, chums. I got a bit confused. A Mondo there, and then a Eclipse. I guess get that locked in and bow. Go on. Yep, that's it. it. That was delayed reaction. But there we go. Chicka pow pum. Awesome. We're heading in. Let's jump. Oh, budget posted for that there. Cool. Awesome. Right now I have arrived, and there we are. Internal nutcase, you sir, are a freaking legend. Thanking you for um, showing me with uh, sharing this with me. I say. You, sir. I mean, you, your avatar has got a picture of a blokey on it, but you know, you never can be too sure these days. So, yeah, thanking you. Awesome. You're a freaking legend. Here you go. I'm going to give you a little gnarly air grab. There you go. Air grab. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. So, oxygen for you. Yeah, a little bit of a dance. There you go. Celebration Mondo. Because you know what? You know, at the moment, we can't really get Quicksilver many different ways apart from running Quicksilver missions. But thanks to you, we can. So there we go, a little wave to you as well. There we are. Right, so I'm up in this station. Just like the comms ball said, reload and do your pulse fishing from the station. So here we go. I've arrived and I have saved. I've created an auto save, which is perfect. And yeah, I'm just going to reload. So here we go, hit reload. Nice. So yeah, bit of an important announcement. I would say turn off your multiplayer settings before you come here because this could get quite busy here and there could be quite a lot of people doing the pulse fish and it might upset things. So turn off your multiplayer just to be safe, safe and sure. Righto, so I have now reloaded. I'm back inside the iteration and we're heading into the Anvil of Destiny and we're going to start pulse fishing. So the way that you start pulse fishing is you exit out of the actual station Aim your ship away from a planet because you don't want the atmosphere to interfere with things. And then you just engage your pulse drives. Yeah, that's why it's called pulse fishing. Heck yes. So once you're actually pulse fishing, you should get a message pop up on the screen. It should have sort of like a reddy sort of orangey sort of tingy colour to it. There it is. Yeah, it's pretty red, isn't it? And there we are. There's the interstellar ice. Now you have to get a bit, little bit close and then shoot the heck out of it. Yeah, you blow up this interstellar ice. And it's not always going to give you Quicksilver. As you can see there, I got myself on the arc side. Which is quite cool if you, you know, you want to start doing a, some sort of glass farm or something. It's, it can be handy. If you do get given something you want, fly back into the station and say. If you don't, just reload right there and then in space. Don't waste any time with flying back. Just reload right there and then. So I'm blasting it again. And you can see there, I got myself some of that uranium stuff, which is great for powering stuff. So again, if you want it, go save it. Go bank it back in the actual station. But I'm just keep reloading till I get what I want. Give me what I want. The one that I want. Ooh, 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 ooh. And, oh, got, got, yeah, condensed carbon. Which is good for making bases sometimes. You, you do need it from time to time. Here we go. Interstellar ice again. Oh, sorry about the signal, by the way. I'm not, I'm not a... Hence the... I mean, I mean, I'm in an ABBA type getup, but no. Anyway, there we go. I got the Quicksilver! Freaking excellent! So it's it's not always that quick. I mean, it says Quicksilver, Pulse Vision. You'd hope it would be quick. It's not. You've got to do a few reloads. There's a bit of patience that come with this. But now that I've got it, I'm heading back to the station. I want to bank this stuff, so I'm landing in the station. I'm going to jump out of my ship. Here we go. Let's jump out of the ship. Jump, man, jump, jump. Save him and save, save. Lovely man, jubbly. <laughs> yes! There we go. Done. Double thumbs up there. Now that I've saved, just to be... <laughs> I, I'm always a little bit. Have I saved? There you go. I've got my quicksilver. Lovely, lovely, lovely quicksilver. Yum yum. Awesome. So just to be sure, I'm gonna save it again. So <laughs> jump in my ship and jump out of my ship. You don't have to. I'm just paranoid. Yeah. There we go. So done. Awesome. Saved. Brilliant. And then I can just reload, rinse and repeat, and just keep doing this and just keep pulse fishing to my heart's content. Now, what I would say is the only thing you're gonna need is maybe some tritium to carry on doing this you know now after you've actually got your interstellar ice up here and you've blasted your interstellar ice so here we go let's, let's get our interstellar ice come up come on you know you want to spawn it usually takes about 15 seconds pulsing this way 
blast the instant stellar ice lovely manjubli hopefully i'm gonna get some more quicksilver and come on oh the lucky gods are with me heck yes that's another 100 quicksilver into the bank so then we're heading back and as you're pulsing back chums to the actual station if you do pulse back you do get a secondary sort of intersection now sometimes this guy he might give you a trinket he might bargain with you and give you a trinket that's happened once to me in the whole time that i've been doing this and i think it was just a sheer fluke anyway if you um, talk to him, he actually sells tritium, and it's only like seven units per clump, so you can buy the whole stack for a, you know, it's not much, but it keeps you fueled, you don't have to just shoot the asteroids, and then when you fly inside of the station and save and bank, jobs are good, you get that extra fuel. So yeah, it actually, you can keep doing this all day without having to worry about your fuel running out, because you can just keep buying clumps off of this little trader every single time that you manage to find your Quicksilver through the interstellar eyes. Heck yes. So yeah, a massive great big thank you to Internal Nutcase. Fantastic find. Thank you for sharing this with us, chum. Awesome, fantastic, and brilliant. Yeah, I must say. And also, he's got a lovely little base here on the actual planet. So yeah, I'll do a little interlude at the end. So please watch. And yeah, double thumbs up. Thank you very much, my friend. And you guys out there, thanks for watching. And I'll see you again soon. Take care for now. Goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Heck yes. Thank you very much for watching this video and if you like what you see please hit a like or a subscribe and yeah or you can support my channel through patreon here are all my patreon backers banking you patreon and i also have youtube membership if you want to sign over to youtube membership check out my video links in my video description i also have merch grab yourself a fine and dandy pair of socks a mug or a t-shirt over in my merch store or i also have atlas cards that i sometimes have in my ebay store check out my video description so that is the end. Thank you for watching and please hit a join or a subscribe or just hit one of these tiles on the screen you see here now. Stay with Captain Steve a bit longer. <laughs>